The world is home to many magnificent natural wonders, and the longest rivers on earth are among them. These rivers have played a crucial role in shaping the geography, ecology, and cultures of the regions they traverse. The longest rivers on earth are fascinating natural wonders that have captivated people's imaginations for centuries. Rivers are a crucial part of our planet's ecosystem, providing water for drinking, irrigation, and transportation. Measuring the length of a river is an important task that helps scientists and geographers understand the river's characteristics and its impact on the surrounding environment. The length of a river is determined by several factors, including the location of its source, the path it takes, and the location of its mouth. The source of a river is typically the farthest point from its mouth, and the path it takes can be influenced by various factors, such as the topography of the landscape, the presence of obstacles, and the effects of erosion. Measuring the length of a river is not a straightforward task and can be challenging due to several factors. For instance, a river may have multiple channels or tributaries, which can make it difficult to determine the exact length of the river. Additionally, the length of a river can vary depending on whether the center or the edge of the river is measured. Moreover, some rivers may flow through lakes or reservoirs, which can further complicate the measurement process. In such cases, it may not be clear how to measure the length of the river through these bodies of water. Despite these challenges, scientists and geographers have developed various techniques for measuring the length of rivers. These techniques include using satellite images, aerial photographs, and detailed maps to determine the exact length of a river. In conclusion, Measuring the length of a river is an important task that helps us understand the characteristics of the river and its impact on the surrounding environment. While determining the length of a river can be challenging, scientists and geographers have developed various techniques to overcome these challenges and accurately measure the length of rivers. Top 5 Longest Rivers The Nile River The longest river in the world is a matter of debate. Some argue that it's the Nile in Africa while others claim it to be the Amazon in South America. However, according to a study published in the International Journal of Digital Earth in 2009, the Nile is slightly longer, measuring 4,132 miles 6,650 kilometers. The Nile has earned the Guinness World Record recognition as the world's longest river. It is formed by the confluence of two main tributaries, the White Nile and the Blue Nile, in Khartoum, Sudan's capital. The Nile originates in Sudan and flows through 10 African countries including Ethiopia, Egypt, Uganda, Tanzania, Kenya, Rwanda, Burundi, Eritrea, and the Democratic Republic of the Congo. The river covers an area of 1,293,056 square miles 3,349,000 square kilometers before it empties into the Mediterranean Sea. The Amazon River is a massive river that flows through Peru, Colombia, and Brazil. While the Nile is officially considered the longest river in the world, many argue that the Amazon is longer. Regardless, it is the world's largest river in terms of the amount of fresh water it discharges into the Atlantic Ocean every day. It deposits more fresh water than the combined output of the next seven largest rivers. The Amazon also has the largest drainage area, covering 2,400,000 square miles 6,300,000 square kilometers, which is nearly 40% of South America's entire landmass. However, Experts agree that it measures only 4,000 miles 6,500 kilometers in length, as opposed to the Nile's length of 4,132 miles 6,650 kilometers. The Yangtze River is located in Asia and it happens to be the longest river in the world. Comparing it to the Nile and Amazon rivers, it measures 3,900 miles 6,300 kilometers in length. The Yangtze is also unique as it flows entirely within the borders of a single country, draining a fifth of China's land area, which makes up 6.3% of the world's landmass. The river has more than 700 tributary rivers and streams, and its watershed, which covers an area of 698,265 square miles 1,808,500 square kilometers, is home to approximately one-third of China's population.
The Missouri River, which starts in the Rocky Mountains of the U.S. and drains an area of 500,000 square miles 1,300,000 square kilometers along with two Canadian provinces, is the longest river in North America and the fourth longest in the world. The Mississippi River, which is the second longest river in the U.S. and only slightly shorter than the Missouri, joins the Missouri near St. Louis, Missouri. Together, their waters flow into the Gulf of Mexico. The river system drains 32 U.S. states. The Yenisei River, which is 2,167 miles 3,487 kilometers long, is located in Siberia and flows into the Arctic Ocean. It is fed by Lake Baikal, which is the deepest, oldest, and one of the clearest lakes in the world. The Selenga River, which is 616 miles 992 kilometers long, originates in northern Mongolia, flows into Lake Baikal and then the lake discharges the Angara River, which finally becomes the Yenisei River. When combined, the yenisei angara Selenga River system, which is the fifth longest river system in the world, measures 3,442 miles 5,539 kilometers in length. Thanks for watching.